Okay, y'all, let's talk about it. I didn't get the job. But that's okay, because you don't, you can't win them all, right? I, I mean, I got like a, a eight in a row winning streak. But here's what I think happened. One of the first things I know about myself is one, I feel like I didn't go above and beyond to wow. I think that I answered everything and I showed that I knew what I was talking about, but I didn't really <laughs> wow. What is he laughing at? But anyways, I didn't really wow the interview. Two, I feel like I went in there a bit cocky. Because it was a manual position, it was kind of like I know I was answering the questions like, <laughs> here's the answers, is that all you got? Now another thing is, I think I fit in, but then there still could be a level of, not that they didn't think that I could do the job, but that maybe I just wasn't culture fit. Maybe they met someone else on the interview who also, they felt like they had a, a better vibe with, right? So all the time, it may not be that you can't do the job, but they don't think you can do the job. But maybe they just didn't feel like I fit within their environment. Now, things I did do right, you know, I was able to definitely speak in scenarios. And I absolutely asked really good questions because I could tell by their energy that they really enjoyed my questions. Now, this wasn't an automation role. However, they did ask me some automation questions. And I really did not, even though you guys know I know, I did not demonstrate my knowledge. I kind of pulled back because I just was tired from an event.